Hi everyone, this is Edo from Framer, and today I want to show you some changes we made to the dashboard with the introduction of workspaces. Up until recently, in Framer you could form teams. They were not too flexible and used to stack up in the dashboard sidebar taking a lot of extra space. We took the opportunity to start from a clean slate. First thing, we added the currently selected workspace on the top left. Similarly to other productivity tools like Slack and Notion, that's also where you can switch between spaces and see which plan they're currently on. If someone invites you as a guest to edit a project in their own space, that will now show under Guest Workspaces. And of course, you can add a new workspace at any moment. In the sidebar, we took the opportunity to improve the visibility of some menu items like Account, Settings, Updates and Community. Then we focused the rest of the sidebar around your projects and their folders. This comes with redesign models as well, including a better way to switch among workspace and organization settings. Having a workspace pre-selected means you no longer have to pick one every time you start a new project. And you can easily see how many members are part of it and potentially invite others. While testing with the community, someone shared that it was hard to find a certain project if search would show results only from the currently active workspace. So we updated it and now when you search something, Framer will show results across all of your workspaces by default. This should now feel much better and as a bonus search was made more performant as well. We hope these changes make working with Framer more efficient. Let us know what you think and happy building.